I'm going to show you how today how to drill break 3.3. This framer right here. Things you will need. Ponish tool and the firmware. If you um you want to be um you want to restore before you do this drill break. So when you restore, pause this video and come back. At the moment there is no drill break for the iPad iPhone own new model, that means like new bot boot ROM. There is no drill broke for the iPod Touch second generation new MC model. And basically how you know if you have those models. If you if you got it like um let's say September fifteenth, that's when um all the um, new models came out, so after that, you would have all the new um, models. So, but it's iPhone, not the iPhone, sorry guys. iPod Touch, third generation, there is a jailbreak. Black, 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 black rain. It's, um, it, it's tethered, so if you, for new people, that if you don't know what that means, that means if every time you turn off your iPod or reboot, 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 you have to use Run Black Rain. So that's it. So let's continue to Ponish Tool. There are some options here there's Extra Mode, Log, and DFU Mode. I'm going to go to Extra Mode. This is iPhone for iPhone first gen. This is for iPhone 3GS and iPhone 3G, but I have an iPod Touch 2G, old model. How, the reason why how I know this, if you go to your um, iPod settings, um, that's in about, and you go scroll down, you're gonna see like a um, model model and it says if it says MC and, and not if it mine says MV, so that means it's um not the old model. So I'm gonna continue here. It's all making a search here, so so here's my three point two. It's gonna find my thing in a sec, and I admit it. Here we go. Let's go. General. This is basically um. Oh, pr partition. If you want a partition, I'm just gonna leave it this at this default. This is for the iPhone 3GS through 3G and first gen iPhone. I can't do that because you know I have an iPod Touch 2G. This is where you can select your packages. You download here, manage sources. So let's say you don't want to add sources on your iPod. You, it's you already add it and you can um, choose your custom packages here's your boot logos um, you can use an um, custom boot logos and recovery logo but I'm just gonna choose recovery different recovery logo than it already has from default I'm gonna keep it at this because I like this and I like this is a little bit better and it has to be dot png file. I'll have a um, actually no. It, it gives you a full description how big it is and how much limit and that stuff. You're gonna select build. And to build your IP, I'm gonna save time, some time since I already made my custom IP I, custom restoral. Uh, I can actually can't do it because um, at the moment I'm not at my house and I kind of forgot my cable, so I can't really do it. Let's say um, I did have connected, it pop up here. Then you're gonna go option, but if you're um on window, you would hit shift and right click. Then you're gonna browse for your custom re restoral that you um, wherever you saved it to. Well, the um, Honest Tool, it automatically saves to your desktop, so that makes it easy. 
and it restored when you're done, you open Cydia. Has should have a jailbroken iPod touch. If you have any problems, just go to DFU mode. Forget to rate, subscribe, and leave a comment. So see you guys. Yeah.